Subby Subbies, how are you doing today? It feels so good to be back with you on this brand new week of adventures and doll fun and toy fun. <laughs> so how was your guys' weekend before I get the show started? I want to know what you did this weekend. Did you have fun? Did you relax? Did you go on a little mini vacation? Maybe you're still on vacation? <laughs> Let's see. My my weekend was really, really mellow. I did not a thing. I actually just relaxed at home, um, trying to clean up this mess. <laughs> it's kind of a mess in here right now. I'm not even going to show you guys because that is crazy. So I'm dusting, rearranging, and cleaning up. And I, what else did I do? I did some reading. Um... But yeah, I kind of just wanted to have a low-key weekend and not really do anything because sometimes you just need that, right? You don't want to do anything. And I kind of just lounged around. So yeah, it was kind of a lazy weekend. But it was a good weekend. What is this stuff? Oh, I got so much stuff in here. <laughs> but it is Magical Monday, so I do want to get the week kicked off with some Disney magic. And today, because I've been missing it, and I absolutely adore this so much, today's video is going to feature the fabulous Edna Mode. Ah! Oh my goodness, you guys. I miss The Incredibles 2 so much. I can't wait until it comes out on DVD because I want to own it. I love that movie so much. It was so much fun. It was so super cute. I love the original Incredibles. And I'm just so stinking happy with this adorable Edna Mode doll. She is so stinking, stinking cute. I picked her up. Why did I get Edna? It's been a while since I got Edna. I think I got her... At Toys R Us, actually. So that's where I um, I first seen these dolls. But you can get them at Target and Walmart. I think they're $12.99, I want to say. I'm not too sure about the price. But it's super, super cute. The back of her box says, Edna E. Mode may be a world-famous fashion designer, but this three-foot-tall dynamo would rather be creating super suits in her secret lab than working with models in Milan. E's one-of-a-kind super suits combine impeccable design with cutting-edge technology and gadgetry perfectly adapted to their wear. And then you got a picture showing you that her glasses are removable. I love her cute little face. So let me pop her out of here and give you guys a closer look. Hopefully I can get her out. Sometimes these little things... Scissors, where are you? Gotta get the scissors. Sometimes these boxes are really easy to open, and then sometimes they're um, super hard to open. Let's see if I can get her out. There we go. Okay, Edna, let me cut you out. I want you to meet the lovey subbies. Say hello. Okay, let me see. There's one on her neck. There's those tea ties in her hair. <laughs> so here she is. She's super tiny. She's super adorable. And she is so stinking cute. I love her big glasses. And I love that they magnify her eyes. Super, super adorable. She's got her signature haircut. Those things I gotta pick out of her head. Um, her head does move up and down. Not too much, but just enough so you could pose it from side to side. Then she has on her outfit from the movie. It's just this long sheath dress. And then she has a Velcro closure all the way in the back, so it is removable. And underneath, she has... Oh, this is so funny. She has painted on underwear with the Incredibles insignia on it. So she has these painted on leggings. Her, um... I guess she doesn't have shoes on? I don't know. I It's it's hard to make out. Maybe she's wearing pants underneath and they have a built-in shoe. So her arms are permanently bent. Her arm is like this. She doesn't have any um, articulation just on her elbow. It could go up and back. And then on this arm too, it's permanently in a bent position and could go up and back. And then her legs... She has the ability to sit down very unladylike. I don't think Edna would sit like this. But she doesn't have any articulation in her legs. Just on her hips. <laughs> so, like I said, I don't think Edna would sit like this. But 
Um, despite all of that, she has limited um, articulation. She is super, super cute. I love her. I'm really happy that Jax came out with these uh, new Incredible Dolls action figures. They're really, really cool, and they're great for your collection. I love all of them. Next on my list, I need to get, and I can't believe I have it, is Mr. Incredible, because... Um, what is what is the Incredibles without the whole family together? So I definitely got to add him to my collection. So this has been my Magical Monday. The new Edna Mode doll from Incredibles 2. Definitely add her to your collection if you're a Disney fan. If you're an Incredibles fan, she's super, super cute. And um, you could get her, like I said, at Target or Walmart. I think she's like $12.99. Um, so yeah, there you go, Miss Edna for your Monday. Can you imagine if we had, I want Edna, Edna, I want you to build me a super suit, girl. Make me a little bit thinner. <laughs> but anyway, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed today's show. I got a whole new week of shows coming up. I think I'm going to do a channel chat. I think I might do a couple of channel chats. I'm not sure. I like doing a channel chat. I just, I don't know. Sometimes I don't know if I, what the channel chat should be about because I'm a little bit nervous sometimes that maybe y'all won't like it. Um, but it's nothing too crazy or serious. It's always toy doll related. So, you know, I want to keep it fun on this channel and like give us all a break from reality because Lord knows we need that. Um, every now and then. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. Remember to love your family, love your friends, but most importantly, love yourself. Be kind, stay positive, and until we meet again in this fabulous Edna Mode world, <laughs> you guys have a magical day, and I will see you tomorrow for Tuesday's show. Bye-bye, guys. <laughs>